One very recognizable sound from the Star Wars series was the radio or voice communication effect heard in battle scenes. I copy, Gold Leader. Move into position. Most notably in the final Death Star assault at the end of Star Wars A New Hope. These vocal sounds have a distinctive tonality that doesn't sound like standard radio interference. These effects were achieved using a ring modulator. Ring modulation is a method of frequency mixing two signals, resulting in a complex combination of harmonics from the sum and difference of the two signals being mixed. A form of amplitude modulation, ring modulation was used in early science fiction television and film production to achieve strange and unnatural sound effects, including the classic voice of the Dalek from Doctor Who. Using a sine wave to modulate the human voice, this kind of ringing, distorted, but recognizable sound can be achieved. Let's try modulating a couple of signals through Mutable Instruments warps to begin. Start by setting warps algorithm knob to crossfade. Hit the mode button once to generate a sine wave, using the level knob to change the pitch. Now let's find a clear spoken vocal track to send through the ring modulator. Let's use a YouTube video of Dr. Neil deGrasse Tyson, so we're still out there in outer space. We can send a signal from a cell phone, an iPad, or a computer directly into warps. And this. And Let's me, route Dr. This Tyson directly into the modulator like, okay, input on warps. Okay. You go to this. Using the timbre knob, we should be able to crossfade between the sine wave and Dr. Tyson. Let's scroll over to the okay, ring mod mode, us. mode three. Apophis. Egyptian god of darkness and evil. We can use the timbre knob to dial in a little bit of radio-like distortion. However, this is important. It's the very first calculation. We can also move over to mode 4, the digital ring mod, to get an even more accurate representation of the sound we hear in Star Wars. It would collide with Earth on April 13th, 2029. Play with the tuning of the sine wave to introduce some frequency variation to the vocal. And so, so, this is the size of the Rose Bowl. At lower rates, we can get the classic Dalek voice effect from Doctor Who. Known to hit Earth. So we may want to try an external oscillator to get those really low oscillation rates associated with the Dalek voice. Occupation of the world, this would be the biggest thing we would know. So better data came along and we learned it would not hit us then, but it could hit us the next time around. How are you using your ring modulator? Let us know in the comments. And as always, please like, follow, and subscribe. This one is sort of a test of a trap for trap for this one because of a business is a trap for trap for this one because of a test is a trap for trap for this one because of a business is a trap for trap for this one because of a business is a trap for trap for